Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Dover Downs here on Thursday. It is January the 26th, 2017. Gonna look at race number 10 from Dover, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at HorseracingKid5 for more selections from racetracks across the world. Today's 10th race from Dover is the preferred handicap post positions assigned. Field of eight pacers traveling one mile per $30,000 is exact a trifecta wagering here. And I'm going to give you an exact wager. And I might box this exact because I think both of these horses have a strong chance of winning. But if I had to give you a top pick, I would go to the three horse clear vision. Um, I would go three, two in the exact. Maybe I'd do, do a $2 exact box. Two, three, three, two, whatever, same thing. But uh, you know, I think that, like I said, I think the three and the two are the two best horses in the field, and they're both at pretty nice odds, five to one and fifteen to one, which is even nicer. But uh, my top pick, number three, Clear Vision, Yannick Jingra, six to one. Ron Burke trains this eleven-year-old gelding out of Western Hanover. Most recent start for this one came last Thursday at Dover in the preferred. Um, this horse uh, finished seven by three and a quarter lengths that day and was far, far behind. Um, at the end of the race, you know, he tried getting lead off the gate. He got fourth off the gate, moved his way up to second at the midpoint, but then really weakened out of it. It wasn't his best at starts. Gets a three-hole post position today, which I think will be the key to this horse's victory. So I'm, I'm happy about that because this horse has been very screwed by the post position draw as of late. But like I said, post position today is pretty good. I think he should have a good start. Start before, uh, start before in the preferred at, at uh, Dover two weeks ago. This horse finished third by half length from the five hole. And, you know, from the five hole, got fourth off the gate, moved his way up to second, but then got taken over and uh, basically sat third the rest of the race. So again, he, he does better with the inside post. And then start before in an in, in, uh, invitational stakes at the metal ends on the 31st on a uh, on uh, New Year's Eve, this horse, um, he, he finished fourth by three and a half lengths as a uh, part of an entry, really wasn't into it. His last win came at Pocono back in November, November the 19th to be exact, and a winner's, uh, non-winner's 24,000 last five starts, horse won by half length, and really ran well on the slop. Um, I, I think he should do well here today. His best time of, 2015, of 2016 came uh, at the Meadowlands 149-1. That was back on the uh, 21st of October. I think this horse should have a good start here today, get you Yannick Jingra, you know, Yannick won with his horse back in, uh, back in October. I think he should really do well here today with the better post. So to recap my bets for race number 10 from Dover, I'm going to go with the three horse. I'm going to go three, two, three, two. So good luck to all and follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5. Good luck, everybody.